Today, Governor Greg Abbott and many other Texas lawmakers attended the West Texas Legislative Summit on Angelo State University's campus. Abbott took time to praise San Angelo, Abilene, and Lubbock for the consistent economic developments and prioritizing infrastructure. About 90 percent of all businesses in the state are small businesses, and they employ about half or more of all the employees in our great state. So with that context in mind, I'm also proud to tell you that Texas ranks as the number one state in America to start a small business. He went on to say small business growth is prominent in Texas and has become the front runner for economic growth. They are building these facilities in areas that are in close proximity uh, to dairy cattle. And so as, as much as this helps in growing jobs for uh, those who will be working directly at these businesses, it also uh, has a powerful economic impact on the agricultural side of our state. Texas has endured many challenges over the years, but leaders believe there's a light at the end of the tunnel. Congressman August Fluger moderated the infrastructure panel and shared his thoughts on how Texas is working to make gas prices more affordable. Texas has a solution. If President Biden would let us unleash the American ingenuity, we could actually solve this problem. But instead, we have an overregulated government approach that is hurting the producers. And at the end of the day, it's hurting every American when we go to the gas pump. But Texas is still leading the way. We can do more. Adriana Alexander, Fox West, Texas.